the idea of working with Terry Date was an idea that was about to happen for a long time. I've been meeting Terry. He's been coming to SoFi shows in Seattle all the time. The last time he was, it was with when we opened for Five Finger Death Punch uh, in Seattle, and he came to the show and we're talking. And I, I throw out the seed, man. It would have been cool if we do, if you do a record, man. You know, you've been doing a lot of cool bands. You know, you try to do a lot of younger bands and stuff. And, and we know each other for a long time. Uh, I met Terry when I did the Deftones album Head Up. Uh, around before I did the song Head Up. I met Terry in Seattle when he was doing that album. I always liked Terry and he has done some amazing records in the history of metal, like the Pantera stuff, the White Zombies stuff, the Soundgarden stuff, the Deftones stuff, Metal Church, Prom. This discography is just amazing and I thought it would have been so cool to work with him because we have this mutual respect between each other. He respects me as an artist. I respect him as a producer. I put him in the same level as Andy Wallace. He's one of the best producers in the world. It came time to do preparations for Savages. I call him and I say, do you want to produce this album for me? I really think it would be great to work together. And Terry was completely excited. Very, very cool. He found a studio in Seattle called Studio X. He's a great studio where Nirvana recorded Pro Jam. A bunch of other bands have done stuff, they did stuff from movies and video games like Halo. It was a great studio and he did an amazing record and the album sounds awesome. And he didn't really think he needed too much work on the songwriting. Uh, he thought the songwriting was great. He really told me like from when he heard it from the beginning. It's like, I'm not gonna change much song. I think the songs are great the way they are. I'm just gonna record them really good for you and make them sound as, as good as it can be. And I always thought that was really cool for him to say that, not to, he didn't get to get too much involved in changing songwriting and start changing song arrangements, because that would become, maybe it would become a problem, and he stayed away from that, so he just recorded him as good as possible. He trusted me as an artist that I was able to make them as good as possible by myself and then record them as good as possible. Yeah!